involved, you're not going to be as nice when somebody's trying to shortchange you. It seems like Kevin Hunter is so concerned about the financial well-being of his new family that he is ready to cross any line in order to provide for Sharina Hudson and their daughter, Journey, even if it means finishing his sickly ex-wife, Wendy Williams, who still remains in critical condition, according to The Sun's recent statements. In the new shocking turn of events, it has been revealed that Kevin Sr. is waiting for his ex-wife's demise because, in this case, he can get her life insurance that he believes he deserves. Hi, everyone, and welcome back to Celeb Live Channel. So, apparently... Kevin Hunter is freaking out every time when he checks his empty bank account, and his financial situation is so grave that he's allegedly waiting for his ex-wife's demise to get that $1 million and cover holes in his budget. As you may know, the nasty divorce between these two didn't end good, and Kevin believed that he was basically robbed and tricked by Wendy. And since no one wanted to listen to his truth, he decided to act differently. And as Wendy and Kevin's son, Kevin Jr. reveals, his father may be after life insurance that the troubled TV diva had been forced to hold for him. This was already happening unbeknownst to a lot of people. You know, only me and my son know really what was happening. Well, there's no denial that Wendy's dramatic divorce took a tool on her physical and mental health, and all of us were basically watching how her life was falling apart because of her treacherous husband. And while it's not a surprise that Wendy's life is currently hanging in the balance after everything she had been through, there's one person who is currently happy to see the former TV host in this state, and this is her ex-husband, Kevin Hunter, who cannot wait to finally pocket that $1 million life insurance. Well, as you know, this man has been blaming Wendy for all his financial hardships over the past couple of years. I want you to come to this meeting, and whatever happens in this meeting, I want you to tell your moms, this is her. And apparently, he didn't give up his hopes to lay his hands on the money. Now, since it's revealed by Kevin Jr. that Wendy is one step away from losing her precious life, his dad, Kevin Sr., is holding his breath and scrolling the headlines, waiting for the news about his ex-wife's demise to appear so he can collect the life insurance she's still holding for him as a part of their divorce settlement. As it was reported by the media, in addition to alimony payments, Williams is also being forced to create a life insurance policy on herself so that in the case that she suddenly dies and the show has to come to a halt, Hunter can continue getting paid. Well, based on Wendy's son's statements and the videos we've seen in the last few months, it seems like Kevin Sr. has all the chances to get that sum. The former TV host has been in the horrible state for the largest part of this year, and she can barely walk without being supported. Hi. Okay. I'm going to core club. And it seems like we've all been underestimating the severity of Wendy's condition. And until her son, Kevin Jr., finally came forward with the details of his mom's scare, people didn't even pay attention to the pitiful state of the former TV host's health. And now it's been revealed that her ex come back to the picture with his hopes to finally get Wendy's life insurance. Just a couple of weeks ago, Wendy had huge plans and was even announced a keynote speaker at the Atlanta Women's Expo on May 20. However, she had to cancel her speech basically one day before the event. And as it was stated by one insider, Wendy's ability to perform has been rocky at best. She can put together a sentence one day, but not the next. There have been serious questions recently about if she will ever get better. And if you think what could have potentially become the reason of Miss Wendy getting worse and worse after the end of this drama with her ex, Kevin Sr., well, let me tell you that her ex-spouse didn't abandon his hopes to leech off his sickly ex-wife. And although the court denied his petition for the alimony payments to be resumed, leaving this man practically broke, he didn't even think of stepping away and was waiting for his moment to collect as much as her can from Wendy. As Kevin Hunter mentioned, Wendy left him no choice when she left him without payments he had been heavily relying on. And if she was more compliant with his demands, she wouldn't have ended up in such a horrible state. No, because we could have handled this a whole different way. By what it looks, this family dynamics shows us quite a disturbing picture of toxic relationship between two adults. And while it's hard to blame Wendy because she has suffered the most in the entire story, apparently, her ex doesn't think he is doing anything wrong because in his own opinion, he is just getting what he has been entitled to since the start. Many fans are concerned that Kevin won't be able to stop chasing Wendy until he gets what he wants. As one person commented, I really don't like Kevin Hunter. Kevin treated Wendy so bad, that's why she can't get well. And another user added, she just needs to disappear. Kevin won't stop. Take her money and leave the use if needed. All abusers play the she's crazy card when they're behind trying to gaslight their victims. Well, it's more than obvious from all Kevin's interviews that is blaming his ex-wife for all financial hardships he is dealing at right now. And although such a behavior is despicable in general, Kevin Sr. knows what he's doing because of this trauma and scandals only aggravate Wendy's health. And as you may know, her state have been quite fragile even before that messy divorce. And Kevin perfectly knew about it. Normally, I would be in a wheelchair. I'm not in a wheelchair. I stand up. Just like Wendy has always been open with her audience during her talk show, she didn't think of hiding anything from the public, including the details of her nasty divorce and her health problems. 
And apparently, Kevin Sr. used her health struggles to his advantage, and the whole mess with court filings and other social media drama was orchestrated by him with one aim only, to ruin his ex-wife completely to that point, that she would lose her mind and eventually her life. Many fans were shocked by the level of Wendy's candor, and especially when it comes to her tearing apart her own image of a gorgeous and sophisticated lady and speaking the truth about the struggles she was dealing with. Sure. Okay. Lymphedema is this. Do you see this right here? Look. Okay. No, look closely. Well, if Wendy's health was so bad even before that drama with Kevin Sr., her problems only aggravated with time. Since the moment Kevin realized that Wendy wasn't planning to provide for him anymore and the court also denied his claims for her money, this man swore to make her life living hell. And it, he intentionally drew attention to his and Wendy's marital problems, hoping to get the public sympathy. Wendy herself was once claimed that she was sick of Kevin Hunter and his mistress, Sharina's plots. And it wasn't for them. The whole divorce process wouldn't have become that hugely discussed in the press. And because of how public those two made it, not me, the paparazzi was everywhere. It feels that Kevin Hunter wasn't planning to end things on a friendly note with Wendy since the beginning. And being stripped of all financial support, he basically declared a war on his ex-wife. And what a huge blow it was for him because he quickly hit the headlines with his tale of woe saying that Wendy made him broke. Apparently, having realized that her ex-husband had intentionally tried to harm her because she isn't able to give him alimony, Wendy got even worse. And this was a bigger blow for the TV diva than just cheating. This time, it felt like a betrayal from the person she had loved for decades. Kevin and Wendy forever. And to this day, it still is forever. Doesn't mean I love you. Not like that. It seems like only one person loved in this relationship. And all this time, Kevin was in this marriage for money. And it hit him hard only after the divorce because he got nothing but his pancake queen Sharina while Wendy was still getting offers for her new projects. And that must have been plaguing Kevin's mind. Men get jealous when you start well, to make more money. It's all been about personal enrichment for Kevin since the start. And apparently, Wendy was too blinded by her love for this man to even notice his cruel intentions. And while the TV diva tried really hard to be respectful, Kevin used her weaknesses to his advantage. And now he's back with his financial claims, hoping that Wendy would soon pass away so he can collect the check and keep spending money on his new family. Many fans believe that Kevin has lost his shame if he is so open about his intentions. As one person commented, praying for Wendy. Can Wendy cancel the insurance policy on which is the beneficiary of $1 million? If so, that might hopefully stop him. It seems like you want her dead because he will collect on the policy. She is worth more to him dead than alive. And another user added, and just for that, she is going to make a full recovery and probably outlive him with this sorry man. So while Wendy is fighting for her life and sanity, her ex-husband is sitting tight waiting for her money to start filling his empty pockets. And as their son Kevin Jr. believes, his dad may be one step away from getting that pathetic million. And what do you reckon? Is Kevin Hunter actually hunting for Wendy's insurance money? And will he be able to finally get what he wants? Share your thoughts in the comments below. I'm eager to know what you're thinking. And in the meantime, check my other videos about Wendy Williams' hospitalization. Well, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned, and I promise to be back very soon.